Okay, so today's Tuesday. It's a little bit of a different day because these two just got back from preschool. And guess what? What? Oh, again. Two days in a row, and I fall for it every time. Guess what? What? Chicken butt. Chicken butt. So, gonna make them some lunch, take Nico to preschool, put her down for a nap, and go pick up a down for gymnastics with her friend, Mim, and then come back, grind out some more uploading and editing, and see where we get. And just like that, they've had lunch. They made a smoothie for me. And mom, guess what? m ms and we're on mom, our way. Guess what? what? Chicken butt. Oh, I just had a smoothie, so I'm freezing. So I'm sitting here by my famous little heater. You guys, I have worn this all week. And while I'm thinking of it, <clears throat> I like to win competitions. I consider myself somewhat competitive. It depends on what I'm competing in. But this is like an affiliate competition for Beehive Meals. And I know that doesn't matter to any of you, but it matters to me. So if you would be so kind to use my code, I changed the code at last. It's code JEWELS for Beehive Meals. You get a discount. I believe it's 5% off if you just get um, a one-time a one time purchase. But if you get a subscription, which is actually worth more bang for your buck, then it's, I think, 15% off. Um, so check the link in the description. If I forget to put it in, if you guys go to the bottom of the description or go the bottom of this um, video in the description below, you'll see a place where it says link tree. And in link tree um, is where you can find all my codes for everything. So if, and I'm sure it still says Boye on there as the old code, but you still can use that um, just in case people still use it. But Jules is also the code for Beehive Meals. They have been one of my greatest partners. Um, I do think that, I think that I was one of their first affiliates and I am super proud to partner with them because they have really blessed my life and the bless of my family members and my neighborhood and friends who have needed a frozen meal. Every year they do a, um, meals for those who need it during the Christmas season and it's just a great company. They are super fast growing and they are in multiple states now and growing quickly. I would love to win the competition. So basically it's whoever use my code, uses my code the most, right? Wins. So use code Jewels and go check out Beehive Meals and order today. And if you don't live where they deliver, surely someone you know lives where they deliver. Right, Bill? He's still with us. I haven't gotten rid of him quite yet, but it does need to happen because he's, he is very aggressive, depending on who is petting him and who is near him. You, you can't even be in his vicinity without him being extremely aggressive. So I did find a family in Idaho um, with older kids that are 19, 17, 21, and then um, obviously the mom and dad and the husband, they lost their 16 year old dog well, not lost, they, they had to put him down, their 16 year old dog who finally died. Um, and so he'll be the perfect fit in Idaho. I don't wanna go get off on the, the subject and go crazy because sometimes you just have to do what you have to do. And, and I, I blame myself for this, but I was, I had limited knowledge <laughs> when it comes to the animal kingdom and it's actually it's actually been fascinating to watch though because he is very I mean he is the alpha and he lets everybody know it and you know he even owns Mabel he'll he will urinate on her I'm, I mean usually just when she's ovulating but I'm like holy crap like he wants everybody to know that she, he owns her it's crazy to like it's fascinating because she really has become his B word <laughs> It's terrible. Anyway, I love him though. Um, and so far we still have him. It might be a few more weeks, but that's the status on Bill. Oh my gosh, you guys, I'm freezing. Look at our sky. 
There's supposed to be a gnarly storm coming in and it is cold, but it looks like I'm gonna beat it because these kids are done in 15 minutes. So I'm gonna race them home, shove some fajitas in them, and then um, kids are gonna go to young men's and young women's. I am going to go to Harmony. I'm ready to put this day to bed. This, whoa, this is a snow squall. Whoa, you see the winds? Whoa, look at the, that. We're getting slaughtered out here. Let's see outside of the back. Don't go outside, you guys. Don't go outside. Don't go, okay, you know what? You're gonna go outside, you're gonna stay here. Oh, watch out, Don. Why are you out there? Oh, I'm not walking there. I'm sure. I guess I will. I'll walk in there. Well, it doesn't do it justice, but low visibility for sure. And I am just so thankful that everybody's home. For once. It worked on our side. Everybody's home safe and I'm grateful. We're back.
Yeah, we got it down. Okay, I don't need to practice. <laughs> what do you say? You got it down? I said, I don't need to practice. Call me. No problem. Oh. <laughs>